Hello, and welcome back to Shotgun King. Um, I'm still... I'm still gonna be doing my very, very best. My very best at beating, uh, very hard mode. I, um... There's a, there's a small chance very hard mode could kill, could kill this series. Uh, I do want very much to, uh, to, to beat it, but like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I'm just not good enough. There's always that possibility. Um. Like, oh, man. I'm already making mistakes, must be said. I know you just you start with so little ammo. Um, all right, I'm gonna have to go here. Can I kill this guy? I can. Amazing. Let's uh let's reload a little bit. There we go. Okay. You know, I, the only thing that gives me hope is that I can beat the first level at all. Pawns plus one HP. Remove one rook. This, I don't know. You know, I generally like adding pawns. The thing that worries me, though, is that they're they're already kind of getting to the end. I can't take that other one, just straight up. Uh, I cannot. Um, if we have extra firepower, I might be able to get away with, um, you know, more pawns. We really need um, extra ability, like extra ammo. Um, that's a thing that was just on offer right now, but extra firepower is going to take a priority. That bishop is, is nicely scuppered. Um, okay, that, that works. Now we need to kill the king before the, oh my god, before the pawns can get to the end there. I'm amazed that the, the bishop decided not to um, block the king, like right there, for instance. Okay, we're, we're, I think we're done. Unless I can win here? Yes. That extra firepower really doesn't feel like enough. <laughs> Increase pawn, pawn speed, we cannot do it. Bishops can move, not attack orthogonally, add one bishop. This is fine. I would love to take fire arc, but I cannot, I cannot increase pawn speed. They're already getting very close. I would love to also take time to kill them, right? To just like wipe out a, a few pawns. That would be fantastic. But the issue is that uh, I don't have a lot of ammo. So I, I can't really do it. Right? Uh... Um, all right, that was fine. We can sneak in here, maybe. No, we can't, actually, because that, that horse, the horse is really blocking me. Um, <laughs> get rid of the horse. Horse is doing me a dirty. And then the king is going to be a problem. And we need to get rid of that pawn. Oh. And they became a... The worst part about them becoming a queen is that they gain, like, a lot of health. Um, okay. We, we still have hope here. We did one damage. <laughs> one damage to the, the king. Um, we're in a lot of danger right now. Can we kill them now? If, if I could do three damage to them now. Yo, we got lucky. Sometimes you, you must be bold in order to progress. You must be bold. Gain one ammo each time you kill a pawn. This could actually be great. That would be fantastic for us. We could 100% use some, uh more ammo recovery. Uh, yeah, it's not gonna do it. It is, like, still very satisfying to, like, shoot a piece right in the face. Let's 
So we just need to, now that we have um, ammo recovery from shooting pawns, we can take a little bit of extra time to shoot some pawns. Oh, that was dumb. Oh, why did I do that? I've done that so many times. All right, all right, we gotta try again. <sighs> they start with so many pieces also. All right. Mmm, okay. We just, uh, you know, we need to get rid of the, some of the big players. You're gonna take four damage on the chin? And, and, okay, we, we can hit the king at the very least. Uh, this is not great. I can't do four damage. Yeah, so we're, we're done now. <laughs> uh, that's like the most frustrating thing about using a shotgun in this game is that it, sh shooting something like one tile away and missing most of your shot. They had four health left, so our odds of like actually killing them was very low. But it still sucks, and it's still, you, you still, you don't, you hate to see it, you know? I feel bad every time it happens. I'm gonna let that rook live. Maybe. Oh my god, okay, I'm not gonna let them live. It takes two shots to kill them. Four. Oh man, we got really lucky with that shot, and then... Okay, okay. As long as we can actually win anything, that means we have a chance to win this mode. That's my justification. Extra soul slot. This is great. Your, your, your bullets pierce through. This is also very good. Alright, let's try this. I know it reduces our power. That may end up hurting us in the long run. In the short run, honestly. But... I got to try it because it might be the ticket. Um, I don't know if this is working as much as I'd hoped. Well, that is something. Uh, this has five health. We can't kill it. Not right now, anyway. Not at our <laughs> at our current strength. Uh, I think I'm in checkmate. <laughs> I don't think I can do anything. Man, it just feels like such a stacked deck. I really don't. I, I'm I, I I like borderline. I'm not enjoying very hard mode. <laughs> Because I don't know, you can't take some of the most, um, like, you definitely can't take that power up. At least, I don't think so. Not for a long time. Not unless you have, like, ridiculous power. Because you just, you don't have the power, the, the uh, power to, to, to kill. Oh, that would have been really nice. I'm pretty sure we're in checkmate now. Yep. Yeah, I, that's good. Um... Only having one shell sucks. Having only five bullets sucks. Everything about this kind of sucks. So it's a very, it's a very, very stacked deck. You don't just have to play well, you have to play lucky a little bit. Okay. My word, my least favorite thing about knights is that they can almost always put you in check again, and they have a pretty high speed. I don't know if certain pieces have higher speed. Yeah, they do. Certain pieces have higher speed than other pieces, and that really bites because it means that, um, you know, knights, since they have uh, a very limited movement range, means that they have a high sp speed. It's not necessarily correlent, but it, I think in this case it is. Um... 
And that really sucks because basically if there are two knights and they generally work in tandem, like they, they will be in sync basically. Deal damage equal to your firepower on a non-king enemy. Okay, sure. We have a we have a wand. I'm pretty sure we can use it once per round. So could we use it on the bishop? Let's get rid of the bishop. Nice. We can't use it on the king, right? So the 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 knights being able to move like between each turn means that we're almost always going to be put in check. And we can't really do anything about that. We can kill them. Obviously, that's what we want to do, right? But um, we don't always have that option. So this is actually going to pay out. That uh, do damage to... Oh, yeah, I forgot about the knight backup. I hate the knight backup. I had to take it. The other one was, was not really an option. We could always save the, the, the wand, but I don't really want to do that. Increase bishop and pawn speed. Well, both of these suck, but extra firepower is going to have to be what we take. And then we can kill a rook right away. Because I can use a wand on the on the rook. There you go. See? This is what happens. This, this is what happens. I'm going to... I took a risk. But, like, it happens every time, and it is it is a little frustrating when you get, like, perma-checked by knights. There is a way to manipulate them. I don't know what it is so that you don't get put in that position. I mean, them being, having, moving on the same turn is honestly um, ideal. Okay, this was, this was good. Managed to get sneak through there. Okay, uh, actually, maybe not good. There we go. Okay, that, that was good. We need, we need more of that. <sighs> okay, charge one additional shell. This is great. Deal eight damage on random enemies. Uh, all right, let's try this one. This is probably ill-advised, but I'm going to give it a go. I'm going to use this. Actually, maybe if I can get a few kills right away, I can... Uh, manipulate who gets that damage. I I truly hate this knight nonsense. Uh, there we go. Died. Knights actually killed me there. Knights actually killed... They have a surprising amount of coverage of the map. When, especially when there's two of them. I didn't even get to use the wand. That was... That was 100% like... The most irksome thing ever. <laughs> Am I, I? I swear to God. Swear to God, I'm a. I'm a. Oh my God. And now I can't do anything. Can't. I can't hit the king. Okay. Now we can hit the king. Except for the fact that. I'm not okay right now. All right, that was that was good. I'm very good at this first level. If you can't, if you can't hear it, my frustration levels are a hundred percent increasing. This is bad. Remove one pawn, add one bishop, negative one ammo max. I can I'm, I will never ever take pikemen. I'm sorry. Never. I don't like this wand e either. I think, I mean, it's fine, but it's not really what we want. Uh, okay. I was wondering, like, are we in danger right now? We, yeah, I mean, yeah, we are. A hundred percent. use this wand now it would have been better if we could have used it a little bit more um, strategically but it'll have to do we hit nothing there 
is wild to me. I, I just reloaded my entire gun and I'm already out of ammo. And now we're in checkmate. I don't know. Very hard mode might, might, uh, might kill this series. <laughs> I'm saying it because it's really, really hard and I don't think I'm good enough to beat it. And it's, it's, uh, it's getting to me. It's making me salty. If I go here, where can they go? <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind trying to figure out what how to play this game strategically because I'm I'm just not good enough to see the pieces where they are. Never mind where they're going to be. I should stop trying to kill the rook. Like I'll kill it now because I wasted a shot on it, but it, it never works out well for me. It's always better to to just try and kill the king before the pawns get their get their way. All right. Open for good RNG on these cards. All pieces negative one speed. Add two knights, two rooks. This wouldn't be good normally, but negative one speed is actually really nice. Jump over a nearby piece, dealing one damage. I don't like that. This is better. Uh. I don't think that the three extra pawns is going to work out for us as well as it normally does, but one extra shot is quite good. So that might actually do it. Um, just being able to stay in one spot is honestly really nice. Look, we can do like two shots on the king right now. Yeah, that's that's going to make a huge difference. Please don't ruin this. Um, okay, we're gonna have to, we're gonna take a shot on the Rook only because I don't think there was a better move there. Uh, well, I guess I'm gonna have to kill the Rook. There's like one damage, yeah, one health left on the King, there it is. Okay, so that extra shell in the in the shotgun really helps. It helps so much. For real. Oh, extra firepower. Engraved uh scope is gonna be really good, but the extra gunpowder powder, that's like super helpful. Okay. Um I'm a, a little bit more optimistic. Just a little bit. <sighs> need to need to cut down these pawns just a little bit. I need that um ability that's like get more ammo when you kill pawns. That would be ideal. Just don't hit that pawn next to you. That's the only thing standing between you and mortality. Oh, okay. At least it's not a bishop. Okay, that was good. That was actually good. King is allowed to right-click to fire all loaded shells. Negative one firepower. We can't do this. 50% chance to knock back enemy. I mean... The extra ammo is honestly the better part of that. Knockback, I've never been able to make knockback work for me. It would be, I guess, okay for pawns. Not much else. That was a nice shot. I got very lucky there. That was also really nice. Ugh. It's like, yay, I'm gonna take out this pawn right here. Nope. Do not shoot this pawn. This pawn actually is saving your life. Don't do it. Um, I should have done it there, actually. Okay, we need to kill... Let me see, okay, we can technically take out this queen, but we need to, okay, we, we, we did it. That was a little bit hair-raising. 
There we go. Do some damage on the king as well as uh, kill the rook. Perfect. Okay, this has promise. We have we we have some promise here. King and queen negative one HP. This is amazing. We don't have any souls, so this is useless. Queen's moves are limited to three squares. Add one queen. This is okay. I'm actually okay with adding an extra queen because they're going to be reduced speed. They're going to be limited in their movement, and they're also going to be limited in their health. One square per 15 turns. This is amazing. Okay, we need to not get... Uh, oh, we're, we're, we were in double check there. Get rid of one queen. We need more ammo. It's really, honestly, the only thing holding us back right now. No! Oh my god! It's not not bad enough that the game is super hard that I have to make stupid moves like that. Jesus. <laughs> I just I just straight up didn't see it. I did not see it. Believe me, I'm I if you're if you're frustrated that I did that dumb move, I am also I am also frustrated at my stupidity. It, I wish I could move here because then they would be, they would they're moving forward, right? But that's not how it works, unfortunately. Uh, I hate this. I don't think I can do anything. Okay, this is what we have to do. We have to move close to the king and then hope that we get this kill. Nope. In fact, we missed most of that shot. I don't think there was anything we could do there. I really don't. Maybe there was. Let me know. You let me know in the comments. How about that? If I'm going to lose and, and uh, get frustrated, I may as well get some algorithm out of it, you know? Okay, we, we got some we got some damage there. Oh, this looks like checkmate, hundred percent. Okay, uh, that's checkmate. Yeah, there's nothing I can do there. If I had two shells in my shotgun, then very different story. But no, even an extra shell in my shotgun, there might have been a different story there. But no. Oh man, I I asked for this. I 100% asked for this when I decided to try very hard mode. Um, okay, there, nope, never mind. Never mind. I always regret trying to shoot the, the rook. It's just such a waste of time and ammo. You cannot, um, you, you actually cannot, like, kill pieces in this mode. You have to go straight for the king. Which means you you put yourself at the most risk. Did I, like, seriously not hit the king at all there? Wow. That is amazing. Cool. Um, I'm pretty sure we're screwed. No, not yet. Very soon, though. I'm, I'm, yeah, all right. <laughs> okay. All right. Die on the first stage. Sure. All right. Yeah. Solid. Good. Um, yeah. No, this is good. All right, I, this is this actually is good, except for the fact that there's still pieces putting me in check. Get out of here, knight! I hate the knights so much. I hate them. 
and the rooks. I hate, you know what? Chess is bad. How about that? How about that one? You don't hear that one too often, do you? Chess is a bad sport. You know what else is a bad sport? Me. Okay, plus one firepower. Remove two pawns, add one rook. Sure. I would like one of those wands again. That was good. If I hadn't messed that up, there was like opportunity for that to be um, decent. I hate you so much. Y'all can go to hell. Okay, the only thing standing in our way is this rook. There we go. Get. Hmm. Ah, uh, we might actually be screwed. I love that. I love that the enemy was like, Almost completely covered by our range, and we only did one damage to them. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be the saltiest episode of basically anything I've ever done. This is, uh, god-awful. Um, yeah, I love this because that gives us an opportunity to kill us ourselves instantly. All right, this is good. There we go. All right, we just need a good card. I, I would really like the one that gives us an extra shell. This is worthless to us because we need another card just to make it worthwhile. This is effectively useless. All pieces, negative one speed, add two knights. I hate that. Hate it. Um, yeah. Uh, the, the game officially hates me. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the jumping, the, you know, jumping power. I, I don't think it does really much for us at all. Oh, I love the bishop. Get down, Mr. President. Yeah, we're, we're we are kind of screwed. I can't even do the jump because the knights are in the way. There. <laughs> All right. Yeah, that's the that's the last time I take that power up. I'll take other worse power ups out of spite because I hate that jumping power. It does nothing for us. I know it's like, oh, but it gives you more strategic movement. No, it doesn't. It's so circumstantial. <laughs> it's so insanely circumstantial when it when it's actually useful. So yeah, n not a fan of the jumping power. All right, good first round. Good, pretty pretty good first round. Nope. Well, I'm taking the blunderbuss. I don't even care what it gives us, what it, what, what it gives the enemy. But also blunderbuss isn't, you know, isn't terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. So if I go here, uh, where can the knight go? Nowhere. Okay, good. But the bishop can. The bishop can, can screw us. Pretty sure, no, we're, we're good, we're okay. Okay. T I took a risk there, a risk which has historically um, gone badly for us every single time, but I needed to. Uh, let's kill this rook. 
I, I really am not feeling good about our odds right now. Okay. No. All right. Yeah. Oh, good. We're in checkmate from the king. Oh, goody. Oh, that's going to be the end of the episode for sure, though. For sure. Um, don't even hit the like button this time. I, I don't deserve it. I'll see you guys next time.